when an intersex child is born, it's not so easy to determine whether this child is a boy or a girl. And there is this uh, desire to have a normal child. I was born with uh, something which they call Morris syndrome, uh, which means that you have um, someone who is designed to be male, but is developed external as female. Usually people don't uh, have idea what uh, intersex is. Intersex is when you are born outside of um, stereotypes uh, of uh, male and female. Usually it is about your genitals, about your reproductive system, it is also about your DNA, it is also about your hormonal level uh, hor and uh, how your body works. He was not open about it at first. When he told me the whole story, I understood how little I knew beforehand about gender diversity, which exists in reality. I face strange reaction, misgendering, verbal abuse, uh, because my body looks different. And very often uh, people call intersex people hermaphrodites, which is completely wrong. Not just wrong, but it is also abusive. Doctors explained to my parents that I have to be arrested as a girl. I think that uh, for them it was uh, strange because uh, to say to someone that uh, his child has to be arrested as a girl, it's not the same as to be a girl. Usually when parents agree with making surgery, they have no idea about consequences of such surgery. Intersex people can live a long and happy life without any surgery. In most of cases, these surgeries uh, start uh, immediately after the question, is it a boy or is it a girl? His childhood, the treatment which he received as a child, when I learned about all that, I, I decided we should not let this happen to any more children in Bulgaria and in Europe, if possible. Making someone normal, in terms of making someone fit into the norm of male or female, is against human rights. We should let intersex people decide who they want to be. We should let intersex children grow as they are. I'm intersex. It is uh, part of uh, my identity. People should be more open to diversity and less afraid of it, because diversity is what makes life rich.